just a few more seconds We almost have a trace We've almost got your location Just need a few more seconds Please don't hang up Why are you still listening? We're just trying to find where you live So we can send you unwanted junk mail And treat your lawn with grass killer Are you still there? Conversing with us so we know you're still on the line Welcome to episode 104 of Madhouse Militia Presents. Mavis Beacon teaches hotel etiquette. We wish to give thanks to the following people for helping make the show go, such as Dwight the Janitor, Wasted Memory for RogueServer.com, which is where we broadcast every Friday night at 10 p.m. Eastern, 7 p.m. Pacific, at RogueServer.com forward slash AKSPA, Dragomir for the Corndown at Corndown.com. We also wish to thank our patrons, such as Brian N., Mig Chungus, Jayad, Ryan T., Travis B., Goldrust, Gordo, Parkman, Crispy808, MST3 Clay, Fancy Pants, Anonymous, Mr. Terroir, Phone Losers of America, Benjamin, Despicable Dogs, Big Boy Farts, 666, Jesus Penus, and Turbo, the High Level Squirrel. Thank you to everyone for supporting the show. You can find out more at patreon.com forward slash Madhouse Militia. You can find our YouTube at Madhouse Militia, our TikTok at Immoral Hole, our website at immoralhole.com. Our archives at travelswithmiriam.com. If you wish to contribute to the show, you can visit immoralhole.com forward slash show forward slash contribute. Thank you for calling Hello. Pipeline. How may I help you? Yeah, you got the pizza there? We do make pizza here. Yes, we do. Oh, good. Good. How can you... Can I get a phone number? It, uh, no. How do you make the pipeline go? We do the dough, put the toppings on, and throw it through the oven. Okay, where does it come out? At the end of the oven. Okay, and will you be there when it comes out of my oven? Are you ordering food or not? Yeah, how long after I eat it does it come out? It takes six minutes to cook. Okay, but after I eat it, how long does it come out of my oven? Pony is the most ordered pizza uh, uh, Hi. I'm here with my family. We we're wondering about eating pizza with you tonight. Hey, okay, I want so how many pizza. do you have? Uh, how many teeth do we have again? Teeth? I got a three teeth. Uh, your mama, she got a one tooth. I got a foul fitting. I'm sorry. What was why that? Why do you want to know how many? Why do you want to know what? how many teeth I got, huh? Why? Uh, no. How many people do you have? Because we're pretty busy right now. Oh, I thought you were asking about my mouth with how many the teeth inside. No. Uh, hello. Is that a prank call? I don't know. We can't end Hello? Hi. I'd like to make Hi. a reservation. Okay. Was this for tonight? Uh, yeah. Um, if you can do it tonight, yeah. Yeah, I can. So our single king rooms would be one forty six fifty four with tax included in that, and then the double beds are one fifty seven ninety. Yeah, that's no problem. I I make dozens of dollars. I'm I'm well to do. 
Okay, so I'll we take the king. I'll take the king bed. I'll okay. take the king. And just one night for you. Yep. Okay. What's a good last name for the room? Um, it's T I T P I E S. And then the first name? Is V A G A N A. Okay. What's a good phone number? Can you read that back to make sure that it's right? Um, so last name T I T C I A S. No, it's T I T. T I E S. One second, please. Sure. <laughs> Let me open my eyes. Did she really hang up? No. Still there. No, she didn't. Oh. I'm gonna hang up though. Hello. Thank you for calling the Grand Stay Hotel in Perm. This is Trish. How can I help you? Ew. 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 Did she say her name was Trash? Ew. Ew. Oh. And gross. Ew. My name is oh, Trish. Disgusting. Have a good night. Trash? Ew. What? I have Ew. a garbage. I have a garbage pail oh. kids card of you. Trash? I live on a new reservation. Yeah, I need a new. Thanks for calling American. This is Chrissy. Hello. Yeah, I need I need a new reservation because something really ew happened over here. Sure. For yeah. what day you thinking? Uh, yet, uh, today, if you have them, because uh, we got an ill situation over here, and something really I, disgusting ew. happened, it's just, ugh, you know? Oh, my God. Let me put my brother on. He he saw it, and he can describe it to you perfectly, because it was just ew. No, I only talked to her. It's gross. It's ew. Someone's got to get over here and clean it. Ew. Going out from the toilet and get fucking sued. Hello? Hello? Ew! Hello? There's something really gross in here. Ew! Did you, did you... Did you see what was in here before you gave me the room? Thank you for Hello? calling the Kinsa and Glenwood Springs. Oh God! Thank God you answered. There's there's a weave on the ground here, and the lady she's very irate with with my my son. He he took it off of her head because he thought it was, you know, he he thought it was um, a wig, but it was a weave and it, it tore at her head something fierce. And I I've I've disciplined him already, but she she's angry. I don't know what to do. Okay. Were you the one that just called us? No, no. God, no. Okay. What room are you in? Uh, 215. Okay, we don't have a room 215. Oh, well, that might explain something. Because my son said it was this place, but I don't think so, because the number didn't look right. Son, can you explain? Okay, yeah, you might have a... Yeah, Dad, yeah, it's, it, this is the place, okay? The one, yeah, I got the number from you know, the lady down the street. This is this is the place, Dad. Okay, Um, you guys do know that we do have caller ID. Um, <laughs> hey, hey, caller ID. <laughs> Hi. What's, what's my phone number? Um, you guys need to stop calling the property. Thank you. No, we have a song for you. Mm. How can I help you? 
Hello? Do you hear that scratching in the line? It's like, no, hi, sorry, my name's Bill. Hear mm-hmm. I hear like crunch, crunch, crunch. Yeah, I'm, I'm outside. I'm working on the phone line, and I, I want to see, like, do you hear any noise on the line? I think you have the wrong number because no one's working on our line. It's Wi-Fi based. Oh, I'm I'm AT and T. We do all kinds of things. We do the internet. We do the TVs. We do the phone. We're not with AT. We do. We're trying to call. Oh, do you want to be? Okay. We got some really good promotions going on right now. Actually, if you bring your phone number over to us, too, your mobile number, we'll give you an additional discount. Cool. Yeah, but we can't guarantee that you'll actually be able to make a call because we recently converted all of our towers mm-hmm. into mind control devices. Yeah. Awesome. You, how could you not hear that sound? Not sure. Really? Hmm. Would you mind coming up the telephone pole and giving me a cup of coffee? I'm really starting to fall asleep yeah, up here. See you in five minutes. All right. Um, make sure you got spikes on your shoes, or you might slide down the pole. All right. Sounds good. Okay. Make sure it's, you know, two sugars, one cream. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. All right, bye. What what if what are the guests doing there? Not sure. Can you transfer me to one of the rooms? Yeah, I'll go ahead and transfer you. Um, uh, one, thank you. Glenwood Springs Cedar Lodge. This is Mariana. Hey, hey, can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you. Okay, because I was talking a second ago. You are pretending you couldn't hear me for some reason. No, I couldn't hear you. Why would I pretend? No, I, I, know, I know you could hear me. Okay, whatever. It doesn't matter. Okay. okay? How can I, I help you? Enough. Okay, whatever. Yeah, I was in the parking lot. I found a set of car keys. You found a set of car keys? Yes, ma'am. Okay, um, and they don't belong to you? No, they don't. Okay, so if you could bring them to the office, that would be great. Well, no, I already sold them. You already what, I'm sorry? I sold the car keys. I got about $200 for them. I was wondering if I had to, did I have to give you half or quarter, or hey. what do I got to give you? Hey, these car keys don't work, the ones you sold me. Thank you for calling Super A Perm. This is Ashley. How can I help you? Hi, Ashley. Yes, hello? Hi. How are you doing tonight, honey, baby? Who is this? Uh, this is Frankie. Listen, I'm looking for a room tonight. I need a room for myself, uh, my brother, his wife, uh, his kid, his dog, if possible. We can always find a kennel locally, you know, if you don't take dogs. It's all right. We do accept dogs. It is a $25 fee per night, though. Oh, perfect. Now, they got this great big big Dane, you know, and he weighs about 170 oh, yeah. pounds, so he's like another person, really. Both. Oh, yeah. yeah, he is. <laughs> All right. Well, what Whoa. can I do for you? You need to get a room? I just want to know uh, where we can bed him. Like, do you have a bed for him? Because he's big. Um, I do have three queen beds or two queen bedrooms. But I don't... Okay. Are you growling into the phone? He, he he's had He's had a treat, and now he Whoa. wants more, you know. Oh, okay. All right. <laughs> Let me put the owner uh, on. Uh, they can describe the situation in grave detail, uh, and hopefully we can have a solution tonight. All right? Here, let me pass it off. Hello. 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 Hello.
Hello. What can I do Hello? for you? Hi, my name is Hello. Down, boy, down. You're not going to get a Scooby snack if you don't get yourself under control. Anyways, uh, my name is Hullabaloo Meldrop, and uh, I'm the owner, and uh, this is our dog. And uh, what was the question again? I'm, I'm sorry, sorry, what did you say I your name remember. was again? Hullabaloo Meldrop. I'm, I'm uh, well known in the area. I ran for city council once, but then they found my dirty magazines under my bed, and I was disqualified. Mm. All righty. Well, I'm going to let you go. Uh, have a good night. They weren't that dirty, though. I mean, they, I mean, it's a lot better than what you find online these days. You know, I was just... I was bamboozled. Bamboozled. Centrine Motel. Hello? Hi, hello? Yes, ma'am. Uh, no, I'm a man. Oh, you're yes, getting off ma'am. on the wrong foot already. Ah, oh, jeez. Uh, listen, I got a little situation brewing out here. Uh, the, the guy, he, he threw a soda at me. I'm drenched from head to toe. Uh, what do I do? Because I don't have a, ch- a clean change of clothes. Do we have a washing machine on premises? Oh. No, ma'am, we don't. Again, you call me ma'am. Why are you calling me ma'am? Why? No, we don't. No, Why? ma'am, if you're drunk, stop calling Why? me. I'm we don't have drunk. any washing machine. Why are you calling me we ma'am? We don't have any. I've already corrected you, and you're calling me ma'am yet again. Why? I'm sorry about that. I'm what sorry about that. What is wrong with you? What is wrong? What's what room going are, on? What room are you staying in? What room What's are you staying in? What's going on over there? I'm not staying here. Are you crazy? I'd never stay with you. You just called me. Who is this? Yeah, I'm on Fender. Uh-huh. We have received a call from you, sir. Oh, shit. I'm sorry, ma'am. It must be a wrong number because I just got a scam uh-huh. likely guy. Okay. No problem. Thank you, sir. What number? No problem. What Thank number? Thank you so much for calling. Uh huh. This is Falsa Peace Hotel. How may I help you? Ew. Hello? Can you hear me? Yes, I can. Oh, oh, good. You can hear me. Good. Listen, there's a guy up here. He keeps playing this horrible music. And he won't stop. Okay. What do I do? Like my kids, they're yelling and screaming at me, like, make them stop, make them stop. But he keeps playing it. And he says, oh, 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 listen, listen, but you, you have to listen. And now he started up again. Now look, I asked him nicely to cut it out. But he won't stop. And it's dirty. I mean, look, I'm going to hold the phone up so you can hear what I'm hearing. What you, where are you at? What is this? Oh, I'm in room uh, 215 over here with my kids. And listen, I'm pulled up to the wall here. You hear this? What the fuck is this? Um, do you know what room it's coming from? I guess it's 214. Let me pull it away. I guess it's 214 or 213 or something like that. Whatever's next to 215, I, I don't know. I, when I walked in, it was near the ice, I guess, you know, the stairs. That whole area. Hey, it's like big you band like my music. music. No, I fucking you like hate my it. Crappy music. I hate it. Fuck it. Turn it off. Oh, I love it. I'm gonna play it again and again. It's coming from the room it's holes. Add an atmosphere to this motel. You won't stop. You should dance in you the won't hallway. Fucking stop. I don't want to hear it anymore. It I'm gonna turn it up louder. No. No. You're not gonna dance. God, no. Hey, Turbo, let's dance this together. Let's get everybody dancing. Yeah. Oh, thank oh, God he turned it off. What, what, what are you oh, going to do about hey. this guy? Hello? Hello? Hi, what, what are you going to do? I don't know what... I don't know... 
Like he's in like the hey. ice machine room. He's gonna. You're not allowed to touch oh, my jam box. I'm touching it. Quit. I'm don't fucking touching touch it. it. What? I'm fucking touching it. I don't. I don't you know. Let go. Come down to the front desk. Hey, we're gonna we're gonna get in the fisticuffs. Let go. 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 Now he's listening to some sort of music from church, I guess. Okay, are you in the hotel it's YouTube. or not? Yeah, we're on the second floor. This is my YouTube channel. I can feel that Everybody he has an erection. Gives me uh, a he's, thumbs up on he's this. dancing real close to me. Come on. So, uh, Let's do the hula. Could you just get a little, a little further away? I really don't want to this feel is a that. a grass sir. skirt. Do you like my grass skirt? I, I do the hula all, all the time to this. Do you have a sister? Hey. Oh, my, my sister Turbo was here just a minute ago. And so were my, my brother Ted. Hey, baby. See, yeah, I told you. You like my coconut bra? I do, and I do. Who lived it? Hey. This is what we do with coconut. We need to make a crawl out of it. We all do it together in the hall. Is this, is this Fossil Creek? Yeah. Was, that, was that the last call? I don't know. <laughs> yeah, see? I'm shaking my grass. Explain to your son why your penis is so much smaller than a man's. Hello? 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 Hello, 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 hello. Hello? Yeah, it's not us. It's Hello? Pleasure. Hello? It's called a pleasure point, it's out. Hello? Hello? Yes. Uh, I'd like to get a room tonight. Me and my family's here, and uh, we really need a room. We're a wonderful dance and musical troupe, and I do the hula, and we'd like to get a room tonight. Need a single bed, sir, or a double Can bed? Can you help us out, sir? Do you need a single bed or a double yeah, bed? Single okay. bed. Single uh, bed, Dad. Okay. Okay, a single bed. My son prefers a single bed. We're all going to sleep together, and uh, we'll be really like cozy that way. How much is the no. difference in price? No, hey. I want a double. You guys quit no. fighting. I'm no. Not you can take you one side. I'll take the other. Win it. You got Win it. Where's D? Hello? Hello? D. Hi. Hi. Yeah, uh, we're, in, we're inquiring about the room holes. The what? I'm sorry? The hole, well, there's a hole in the room, and our foot got stuck, and we got bent all around, and then our hand got stuck in another hole that we, we managed to get ourselves into. I... I'm sorry. Where Where are you? I'm in the I'm in the room here. I got my my foot stuck in a hole. And oh, my sir, stuck where, in the where hole are well. you? You're stuck in the hole. I'm out get here next to the hole here. And get my finger out of the hole. Nope. The hole oh, is that. trapping my foot and my hand. We're out here. Where now. are you calling from? Uh, outside. Where are you calling from? Outside, out, out here by the building here. Uh, it was we'll tickle your other foot. No, don't tickle. We'll tickle me. your no. foot. No, 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 that's not helping. No. 
uh, hi, uh, I have a situation here in the room. My body's elongating. Uh, spirits are high. Uh, everything's okay, but I'm just I'm concerned about the elongation uh, effects of the hotel. Uh, if you could give me a call back as soon as possible, that'd be great. Thanks. Thank you for Hello? calling Hotel Northampton. This is Nick at the front desk. Hi, hi, Nick at the front desk. Listen, do you have a janitor down there? A janitor? Yeah. We got a situation brewing in the toilet here. Uh, my son, he clogged it earlier. I thought I got it unclogged, but uh, we left for a little while for you know, dinner. And now we come back, and he had to go again. Uh, yeah, he's in the background there, but uh, it's... Yep. What room are you? Well, that's the thing. I don't have the, uh, the wherewithal at the moment uh, to uh, give you that. I'm not sure. Uh, I think it was 215... But I, I drank. What's your name? Johnson. Harry Johnson. Johnson, all right. Let me, yeah. let me look you up right here. Oh, Dad. He called his good. mother a curse word. He's in so much pain on the toilet here. Dad, that's not good. It just came out like lava. I'm going to prank call. Uh, I don't have a Harry Johnson here. It's not a prank call. God damn it. What the hell? We went to a hot dog eating contest, and now we're sick as a dog. And here you are, saying you can call Dom prank call. I was there, it happened. Thank you for calling for a friend in Holyoke. Good evening, this is Marvell. Hello? Marvell? Yes? Hi, Marvell. How are you? Finding you. Good. Um, so we want to make a reservation for a room. For what day? Uh, Monday. Okay. Let me continue with reservations. Just so much feel like. Uh, okay. It's not so much the services and no. amenities themselves. No. No. Hi. You've reached reservation. No. Reverend Dolan, how can I help you? Oh, my God. Hello? Hi. Hi. Do you have uh, Mavis Beacon teaches typing as part of the room? I'm sorry, what? The amenities in the room. Uh -huh. um, do you have a computer program called Mavis Beacon teaches typing? I'm not sure, to be honest. Oh. Uh, okay, yeah. I'll make a reservation anyways. Yeah. For tonight? Yeah. Okay, so there's a shift change. So, like, if you could just call back in 10 minutes, that would be great. At the moment, our computers are down because we're switching shifts. Okay, can you write my name down that I called so people will know that I'm calling back? I will let my coworker know that you called. What is your name? Uh, it's B U T T I, I just need the first name. K S. That is the first name? Yeah, it's B-U-T-T-O-C-K-S. Yeah. Okay. I will let them know. So just call us back in 10 minutes, okay? Thank you so much. Okay. Bye. You're welcome. Bye-bye. He so didn't write it down. Yeah. Hello. Thank you for calling Foley Water Casino. This is Officer Ryan. How can I help you? Hello? Mm -hmm. Yes. You. It smells bad in here. Man, it stinks. It stinks? Did you take your shoes off again? No, that was I took me. my shoes off. Yeah, you took no, your so shoes bad. off at the front desk, and now the whole hotel smells bad. Do you have stinky feet, sir? sprays for that kind of thing. Do your cat and dogs <laughs> guys, run away from your feet? Cat and dogs, sir? Yeah, um, he stinks. I, 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 no, I think the guy there at the front desk, his feet stink because 
Last time I tried to bring my dog to the hotel, he had one sniff and ran away. I never saw him again. Really? Do you have any, like, standards of cleanliness for the feet? For the feet? Standard cleanliness for the feet? Uh, which hotel is this? Uh, the one with the rooms and the beds and the people, the sleeping people, and the luggage. Uh, and the luggage? And the extra, the luggage and the extra marital sex. Yeah. Uh, no, sir, no. It stinks bad? Okay. Well, I'll make sure I note it to my supervisor. Yeah, can you please let your supervisor know that there are people having relations in your rooms? I will get on it right away. That is not acceptable. Yeah, you need to run a sex-free establishment, you know, honestly, to be credible in this world. Uh, well, I love your feedback, sir. You can hear you can. that. Please put it on Google, please. Yeah, um, I'll put my feedback on Google if you keep your feedback from the guests because they smell off. <laughs> All right, thank you. <coughs> oh. You just called me. Who is this? You just called me. This is Richard at the Daniel Seventh House. Uh huh. I I couldn't get there fast enough. Oh shit! I'm sorry, man. It must be a wrong number because I just got a scam likely guy. Oh, I'm uh, no problem with the wrong number. We run a bed and breakfast in South Hadley, Massachusetts. What number? Four one three. What number? Five. What number just called you prior to me that you think is a scam? Um. I thought it was you that just called, and I couldn't get there fast enough. Hold on a second, ma'am. I can't hear you very well. Hold on. Sure. Okay, what number called you prior to you calling me? Uh, hold on. Let me see if I can pull it up. Say that again? Um, I ain't playing shit, ma'am. Um, I've got a landline here. I'll have to uh, check and call you right back. I just got a call from you saying it was a scam likely, so I think you got the wrong number. Oh, that could be. I just pressed redial. Nah, uh, yeah, I think so, actually. There's a good chance of that. <laughs> <laughs> but, uh, no, sir, I wouldn't uh, be calling anybody at this time of night unless they called in. Well, what the fuck are you, then? I, I'm just up late. <laughs> I'm waiting for guests to show up. What number did you just try to call? Um... Bitch, don't fucking throw those fucking shade at me, motherfucker. I was calling you back trying to be halfway decent. You called the wrong fucking number. What number did you just call prior to this? So, hey, how about this? First of all, watch your mouth. Second what of all, I was responsible. Like three uh, seconds ago, I had a call from this. You just called me. Who is this? Yeah. Uh, this is Michael. Oh, shit. I'm sorry, man. It must be a wrong number because I just got a scam yeah. likely. Uh, what number? What number? Seven eight five three two. Did I change the? Uh huh. Yeah, did I change the number or something? Or like? Trying to do What number just called you prior to me that you think is a scam? Your mama. That you think is a scam. What number called you that you think is a scam? Hold on a second, ma'am. I can't hear you very well. Hold on. Thank you. Okay. What number called you prior to you calling me? See, but why was he cussing so much? And like, that's just so weird. Say that again. Hello? I ain't playing shit, ma'am. Yeah. <laughs> I just got a call from you saying it was a scam likely, so I think you got the wrong number. You just called me. Who is this? Hello? Uh-huh. Who is this? Oh, shit. I'm sorry, man. It must be a wrong number because I just got a scam likely guy. Oh. This is not the wrong number. What number? I... Wait, are you at the hotel? What number? Are you at the hotel? Uh-huh. What room number? What number just called you prior to me that you think is a scam?
Okay, John? who are you? Hold on a second, ma'am. I can't hear you very well. Hold on. Okay, what number called you prior to you calling me? Um, I had a number from from the hotel that called me. Say that again. I had a number from a hotel call me, and it popped up with your number. I ain't playing shit, ma'am. What? I just got a call from you saying it was a scam likely, so I think you got the wrong number. I got a call from you saying, like, it was, like, music playing in the room 215, and they were, it was coming from, like, 213, and you were saying in my hotel. Nah, yeah, I think so, actually. There's a good chance of that. <laughs> what the fuck are you, then? I missed the What number. room are you in? What number did you just try to call? Your number. Bitch, don't fucking throw those fucking shade at me, motherfucker. I was calling you back trying to be halfway decent. You called the wrong fucking number. What number did you just call prior to this? We did, no, we, not, we did not call the one number. What the fuck are you talking about, bitch? Like 30 seconds ago, I had a call from this exact number that I called it back. Dude, we did not call the one number. Sir. I'm not mine. I'm in the office and beat your ass. This guy's fighting demon and shit in the hotel. What the fuck are you talking about? Well, what about my mother? She's dead. <laughs> no, I did not talk about the mother. I was talking about the patient. <laughs> what number? Tell me. Wait, come down to the lobby. Motherfucker, you're not. I don't know what the fuck you're talking about. What number did you just call prior to this? Tell me. Like, numbers. What are you talking about? Tell, call you call you tell me a call number. Call what number did you call? We called 209. Jesus Christ, Three, you're stupid. One, what one, number did you call one, before this? No, no, I call it two zero nine seven. Jesus Christ, lady, what is your fucking problem? <laughs> I'm not a lady. So. Funny, actually, this is making my day. <laughs> what number did you call me? Get... Tell me. Yo, man. Hey, you made my pronouns wrong. I am a boy, not a girl. I'm gonna get that weight right, right now, so we can go up there. Uh huh. I'm a, I'm a boy, right? What fucking number? Tell me, lady. Okay, I'm not a lady. I'm telling you this again. I am a boy. I'm a boy, not a lady. You're fucking dumb. What number did okay. you just try to call? Tell me. Was it Are, are you at the hotel? I think we're having we communication two, here. Two, two, what are you talking about nine. dogs? Do you like fucking dogs or something? You're weird, lady. Just tell me. <laughs> <laughs> I like dogs talking to people. Are you at the hotel right now? Why do you keep bringing up fucking animals and dogs? You're weird as fuck. I'm just asking you what number you tried to call. I'm okay. not dodging that dog. Okay. There's a dog out there running, and you need to get it. It's your dog. What the fuck are you talking about, lady? Uh, I'm not a lady. I'm going to tell you this one more time before <laughs> I come to your room and beat your ass. <laughs> you can hook me up? Wait, you see? Yes, I'm going to hook you up. I'm going to beat your ass. Do you see the checkers? Sounds like you got the fucking hookups there, ma'am. You bet you got the fucking best drug dealers in town. Yes, I, yes, I do. I wish. You want some, sir? <laughs> what number are you calling, ma'am? Okay, I am calling 2097, and I'm not a ma'am. I'm a boy. Jesus Christ. What room number are you do in? Do not use the Lord's name in vain. Tell me more about the drugs. You got fucking life experience with these deals? What's going on here? Do you have a fucking crackhead? I mean, you sound like a crackhead to me. I'm actually on heroin right now. My mom's chiming in. You're fucking retarded. What number did you call? Was it four, Did it start with the 427? <laughs> hey, hello. No. You sound like a fucking robot, lady. Like, I, I don't think you're understanding me. You just called me. I'm calling you back. Are you in the hotel? Why the fuck would you call me first? I'm trying to ask you what fucking number you called, idiot. Brother, are you know. Okay, well, I just got a... Okay, so I'm working at the front desk right now. I just got a prank call from this number. So I'm trying to figure out why you're calling me. Was it four... Did it start with the 427? Or are you going to be that fucking hard-headed no, like, and retarded? You're fucking hard-headed and retarded. Okay, I got your number. Your number was the one that popped up. Nothing. Are you in the hotel right now? 
That's what I fucking figured. Are you in the hotel? Jesus Christ, lady. Are you in the hotel? What did the fucking number start with? I think you got a wrong number here. Are you in the hotel? Jesus, you're a jackass. Are you in the hotel? Sir, if you do not tell me if you're in the hotel, the cops are going to come and they're going to send you a number because you will not tell me. You keep playing calling me. It's not funny no more. I'm trying to go home. I need to take shit. <laughs> I know your number and I know your name. I think I'm back. coming down the fucking stairs. AR. Hello? He just overdosed. <laughs> just like you. Give me his number. I'm gonna call that fucker. <laughs> Should we do the prank call app on the Do the cop one. Oh, you got drugs? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, you got drugs? Yeah. Hello? He's definitely coming back. Sir? Dance and Eagle Casino, how can I help you? Hi, yeah, the machine's broken. I I pull on it and it it goes rrrr and then nothing. It just it stays. It's like it it, it stops the time. Okay, let me send you let me send you to uh, slot tech. Hold on. Oh yeah, let me see that slot tech. <laughs> okay, hold on. All right. Oh no. Yeah. I'm going to try security. Touch. They didn't answer. Hold on. Okay. This slot is it's doing miraculous oh, things. Touch it. Okay. That's me. Go security. This is Colin speaking. Guatzi, thank you for calling Sky City Casino and Hotel. My name is Laramie. How can I help you? Yeah, who put this song on? It sounds like a little offensive. Do you hear this? You guys are playing a pretty offensive song. It's like talking about a motherfucker. I can transfer you to security. Yeah, go ahead. I mean, I want to know who's playing this song because it's not appropriate out here. I got, I got, not my kids. They're my kids, but they're of age. You know what I'm saying? But they're my kids still. Damn it. Sure, no problem. I'll send them to security. Sure. Thank you for calling Sky City Security. Yeah, I don't know why they sent me to you. There's this, like, kind of a lewd song playing. And I'm here with my fucking friends and my family, and it's saying motherfucker and shit. Where are you at? Do you hear that? Yeah. Who's got this playlist? This is, like, pretty crass. It's, like, explicit. Where is it at? I'm out on the floor. You hear that? It's saying on touch the it, touch floor? it, you motherfucker. Yeah. And it's upsetting oh okay. me and my family. Okay. I'll get a hold of somebody. So something, there's like, something like a horsey cat, it said. It's explaining okay. it's like some animal with a huge penis. Honestly, the more I hear it, I'm starting to like it now, but the lyrics are so lewd. Okay, I'll, 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 I'll let them know. Son, stop stop bopping your head to that. Stop it. Stop tapping your foot, honey. God damn it. Damn it, my yeah, family's starting yeah, to dance to yeah, this music. Yeah, yeah, this yeah. is not Christian, guys. You sing a prayer right now. <laughs> my name's not David Hartcross. I will exercise this goddamn good song demon out of you. Touch it. Touch it. I don't know what's happening. My arms are moving and I'm doing that wave thing and I've never done that dance before, sir. Help. That's oh, a fuck, good I'm dance. now. Sir, it's taking over me like a demon. Help. What are you twerking for? Quit twerking. Honey, get... Find Dwight. 66 Casino, how can I help you? Hi, yeah, we're out here in the uh, near the casino floor and there's a really weird uh, song playing out over everything and... I'm getting closer to the speaker here. Do you know about this? 
My kid's wondering about it, cause, but it sounds really lewd. Is this supposed to be happening? Hello? I don't know, sir. I'm it's not... It's really weird. Cause he, yeah, you hear that? It said MF. MF or you. And it starts talking about touching things. I can... I don't know. I can... I don't know how to go about that, but... Because my son, he's wondering what... Son, stop listening to it, please. See, it's talking about genitals. Yeah, motherfucker, yeah. No, son, no, you can't say that. Ma'am... I'm dancing with the beat. Well, what do I do? Because we tried... We went up to the room and, you know... It's just, it's playing on the speakers everywhere. I don't, I don't know, sir. Let me check. Yeah, touch it, motherfucker. No, don't. Hey. Yeah, no, you can't say that. What does soup? Thank you for calling Kelton Buffalo Thunder Resort and Casino. How am I direct your call? Hi, yeah, uh, we got a situation out here, man. There's some weird music playing outside here, and my kids are they're freaking out about it. They said, oh, it's saying this, it's saying that. I, I'm going to get closer to the speaker because I think it's a good idea for you. To, you know, I don't know if this is supposed to be playing out here. Oh, that's my jam, motherfucker. Yeah. Oh, cut a You can't say that. Sorry, Dad. It's just such, the music's taking over. Is this supposed to be doing this? Oh, uh, where are you at? We're outside, uh, on the outside here, or by the trash can machines. Yeah, clear this uh, table off so you can dance, Ted. Security, give me one sec. Oh, okay. For crafts and jewelry to brand... Oh. Buffalo Thunder Security oh, Officer, around. Hi, yes, my Body son. Body of a horse. My son, they alerted me to this loud music. Well, they're saying curse words. Out here. Is that supposed to be happening? I'm sorry, can you repeat that? Yeah, there's there's music playing out here on the speakers and they're saying curse words and my son they started singing along to it and it's all horrible, it's terrible. Yeah, touch it, touch it. Watch me do the worm, motherfucker. Where where are you located, sir? I'm out here by the uh, trash machine. And there's a car there's cars here. One guy almost hit me. That's why I called, because I thought it was really weird. There's weird music playing, and there's people acting weird, driving people almost over, you know? Like, what's going on over here? So you're outside by the main entrance? Yeah. Okay, yeah, I can send a sergeant over there. Oh. Hey, are you guys over there doing the cross? Now, what is this? Yeah, you put your arms like yeah, this. Yeah, let's all do a cross. Yeah. And then it's all in the legs. Uh. And it's a cross. Motherfucker. Uh, <laughs> 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 so, man. where is your I'm location really so I can send a sergeant? Oh. It stopped. Yo, yeah, where's the music? Uh. Wait. Put it back on. Maybe on. someone figured out there was something wrong with that. I, I guess oh, that was I thought we were uh, dancing uh, here by the by the dumpster. Yeah, What's by, going on? It's like you motherfucker, you. Okay, I, I guess touch everything's it, good then. It. Oh. This is Byron. Hi, this is Jennifer, historic Elgin. Is there a point to this? Um, I missed a call from you. How should I know? It. No, I called you back. I don't even know who I'm you at are. The historic, the historic Elgin Hotel in Marion, Kansas. Oh, okay. Um, I was calling you back. I missed a call from you at some point. You didn't tell me why you were missed. concerned. Me? Yeah, yeah. Why are you concerned? Oh no, I call when I because I I work here. I'm the manager, so I call back. Any why are phone you call that I Why are you concerned? Um, just to make sure that there wasn't something I could help you with. Why are you concerned? I don't understand. 
Why are you concerned? Why are you concerned? Uh, just in case that you needed something from the hotel? I don't want um, you to explain like a, it to me. I never asked you to explain it to me. Oh. I said, okay. why are you concerned? Uh, in case I needed that you needed uh, a reservation or needed... Are you still talk talking? Somebody Yes? I'm not yelling at you. I'm talking to you. Hello? Why? Why why does that concern you? Why does that concern you? I Who cares? I okay. So why are you telling me? I'm sorry. Why are you concerned? I'm sorry. I don't know the answer to that. <laughs> I want to hear why. Tell me why. I. Why? Why? Because yeah, somebody, why? If why are you concerned? Well, if someone calls the hotel and I miss their call, I get concerned that they needed something or had a question. Take, name, give me one good reason. Because I care That's about the point. Who cares? Guess. Why are you concerned? I don't know. I said, why are you concerned? Because it's just... Yeah, you are. Kind of you are. Okay. You well, didn't tell me why you were anything. concerned. If you do need anything, I mean, you can feel free to call me back or make, if you wanted to make a reservation or... Why are you concerned? Why are you concerned? I don't know the right... Why does that concern you? Why does that concern you? What, oh. Why? Why were you concerned? I just didn't know if you needed anything. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Did Why you, are you concerned? Well, because the only way that I can answer your question or to give you Why any, are you any concerned? help that you may have needed is to call you back and ask. Why are you concerned? How can I help you? Hi, yeah, I'm a fat motherfucker, and I was worried about breaking your beds. Uh, do you have a weight limit on the beds? What number? Oh no, I'm not. I'm not here. I'm not there yet. I was just wondering if it's okay, like for a fat motherfucker like me to, you know, use your bed, because I'm really fat. I mean, I've been I've been fatter, but I'm really fat. You, like, you, you know, need fat, room. You need yeah, room. I need big room, big room, because I'm a big man. I have big man parts and big man things to do, you know? So I give you king bed, okay? Oh, wow, you have one? Yes, king bed. Oh. Can I have you over? And we can bounce on the bed. You know, we can just, you know, jump up and down for a little while and, you know, maybe have some hors d'oeuvres and some cheese and bread and, you know, I can I can order food. I, I, I can order wings. What time do you come? Uh, probably, oh, it'll probably be like an hour or two before I get there, honey. Uh-huh. And uh, one one person? Uh, no, it's myself and my my my, my pet horse. Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. Is that all right? You have pet? You have pets? Yeah, it's, a, it's a mini horse. He comes with me everywhere. <laughs> he takes care of my bags. He holds them and he rides with me. And we go nah. place to place and... Uh, and sometimes, you know, um, do you know what is uh, Gandu? Uh, I'm sorry? Do you know what is Gandu or no? No. Oh, okay. Let me put you on with my horse. Here, horsey, take it. <coughs> no, 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 no. I have no room. Hello? No. Hello? 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 Hello?
Hello? È rima di là, prendi. Gandu! Tira la sciamia e te roboti tabab, te roboti tabab, la idea. Nei! Quando sei qui? Già? Quando vuol dire io? Eh, I think this, this hey, horse is pooping don't now. Don't say bad words like that, Susie. Yeah, that's not nice. Okay, thank no. you. I have no room. I love okay. you. No, I am Bob Ma. No. Continue Hi, Grant, this is from this here. This is Mary. How may I help you? Hi, Mary, Mary, quite and cherry. Uh, something about your pussy being hairy. I don't know. Uh, how are you doing tonight? Good. How are you? Oh, I'm good. I've been I've been uh, intoxicated. Listen, my my friend told me to call over here and see if you had a room. I got my myself and my and my uh, adult children with me. They're all here in the car with me, and they're driving. They're driving me crazy. Do you have room for four adults? Yes, when are we girl. gonna get there, Dad? Yeah. I'm working on it. I'm working on it. Well, here, I need more chips. Mary, Mary, quite so hairy. Oh, is that how it goes? Do you know, Mary? She stuffed it up and it was dairy? Dad, Little old lady. Hello? Little old okay, lady so lived in a shoe. She so had so many kids. Her uterus fell out. Oh. Are we going to get a place to stay or what? Maybe. Shut up, Mom. So You're the one who wanted to van life it. It's going to be so fun to live in a van. And I was like, dude, like, where am I going to shit? You watch these people on YouTube, like, all God, live in their is van. Is there even a room? Oh, gosh. Hello? Is there a room? Is there a place to shit in that room? Because there's no place to shit in this van. Fuck van life. That's what I say. Okay, so... Where am I, I haven't bathed... Uh-huh. I haven't Our bathed in six months. Out. Is that a problem? <laughs> hello, like Jonathan Fritz and Beyond Belief. Hi, yeah, happened. yeah. Hello, hi. Hello, yeah. Hi, yeah. You're incorrect. I'm sorry. You're incorrect. I I heard what you said. You're incorrect. That's that's all wrong. I have no. Who is this? Oh, this is the guy, you know, I just I just made it in there. I just got, you know, settled. But I think you're incorrect. Yeah. About? Oh, it was, it was what you were saying about the locals. You said, oh, they're disgusting people, you know. You said they're disgusting because they smell really bad and they don't wash well. And they're, I don't know. I don't think you said they were foreign or anything, but you said, oh, they're disgusting. And then some guy here, he's like, oh, I'm I'm a local. And he doesn't smell bad. He's not disgusting. I don't know what you're talking about. You're incorrect. <laughs> smell these pits. I don't, I don't smell like bad. Come on, that's bullshit. You said these people were disgusting. They were dirty people. Get your nose up in this, bud. See what I'm saying? This ain't, that ain't bad. I don't see what's dirty about what them. Yeah, from under cheese is not that bad. Are you, you talk hey, have a good night. Oh, Thank I'm you. The Lodge at Russell, this is Tracy. Can I help you? Hi, Tracy. Uh, do you know where I can wash myself on premises? Like, is there a river nearby or a ditch? I have no idea. Uh, okay, well, how about the tub? Is is this a serious call? Yeah. Are you a uh, guest here? Oh, no, I'm just walking by. I just wanted to know, like, okay. if you knew, like, I gotta go. the, the lay of the land. Barbara Carr Thank you for calling Castle Rocket and Suites. This is Matthew. How may I help you? Hello, Matthew. I'm going to check in there with my Barbara Carr quartet. And all my friends will sing with me now. Hello. 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 Hello, Hello dear. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, we will need to be not disturbed while we're practicing. Hello. 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 Hello.
hello. A Scooby Doo. Hello. 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 And twist it around. Hey <laughs> They're a bunch of rowdy boys, I'll tell you that much. <laughs> okay. Alright, so can you accompany me? Uh, accompany no. me. Accompany, accommodate, accommodate. That's the word. Accommodate. Accommodate. Accommodate you. Accommodate. Hello, my baby. Hello, my honey. Hello, my hotel ho. Hey, so, um, can we stop fucking around and maybe just get this room booked? I'm sorry, what? Yeah, can we get this room booked? Sure. How many people? Um, I don't know. Everyone chime in. That sounds like a tenor right there. I think we need a good tenor. He sounds, sir, could you give us no, a note? No, maybe six. I don't oh. like Greg. Greg is not staying in the room with me. Why not? Because Greg is going kind of, to... I want to say it. It's not your problem. Hello, my baby. The Hello, my darling. Hello, my ragtime gal. See, that was slightly flat. You got you to... Gotta, See that he was slightly Are you in the room. Good. Yeah, I want a room. I need people? like three of them, maybe. No, yeah, definitely three. Three rooms. Hey, can can um Man, can I ask you a small question? Life gleams, we gather round an old familiar scene. With our voices, we harmonize. Oh, so shit, it's that other voice. We've got our sight. Oh, man, they think it's so much better than I them. was a boy. I was a small boy from a Sing small at him, family. Boys. Sing at him. That's such an antler. It's done with spring. How may I help you? Hi, antler. How are you? I'm doing well. What can I do for you? I lost my shoe in the pool. I was wondering if anyone turned it in. Your shoe? Uh, yes, I can't well, find my shoe. I have one shoe. It would be in the, the it was, it was like in the jacuzzi because our pool is closed. Yeah, the little pool. I call it a little pool. Yeah. Um, are you still here in-house? Yeah. Okay. Um, I haven't gone over there to close it down just yet, so if you left it there, it's probably still there. All right, so no one's turned it in? No one's turned it in. Now, do you, if I, when I go to close the pool and I find a shoe, do you want me to bring it to the front desk so you can come pick it up in the morning? Yes, because it's a size 16 shoe. 16, okay. Yeah, no problem. If I find a yes, shoe, I will bring it to the front desk. It, it might clog the pool. It might clog the pool. Okay. Yeah, no, I don't know anything about a shoe just yet, but when I go over there in about half an hour to close it down, I will look for you. Make sure no one steals my shoe, please. I'm sure no one will take your shoe. It's only one, after all. Wait, do you have it? I don't have your shoe, no, sir. <laughs> I'm still at the You have my head. shoe. I do not have your shoe. <laughs> Wink twice Alrighty. if you have my shoe. Uh, I will look. What color is it? What, it's if red. It's wanna, like a if, big clown if shoe. If you want to walk down it's to the It's a big jacuzzi. red clown shoe. Okay. It's a big red clown shoe. Okay, got it. I don't it goes honk when you squeeze is. the tip. It goes, ho, oh, oh. <laughs> ho. Okay. All right. Well, you're welcome to look if it's still there. Otherwise, I'll see what it's there in about. No, I'm going to come. I'm okay. going to come and inspect it with my friend, the mouse. Uh, okay. Sounds good. You have a good night. <laughs> Bye. No, wait. Do you have matches? We don't have matches. No, sir. Lighter? No, we don't. We don't promote fire here at the hotel, but there's a come and go on the corner. Candle? We uh, we don't have fire. I'm sorry. Torch? Nope. No torches. No smoking in the rooms, please. Glow stick. All right. You have a good night. <laughs> Thank you for calling Corey of America on strings. How can I help you? Slow down. Hello? What would you say? 
Thank you for calling Courtyard Mayor at Glenwood Springs. How can I help you? Oh, thank you. You said that really fast, and I have a problem with hearing fast things. Lady? How can I help you? I would like one Hello? room. I would like one room. Do you need to make a reservation? And it has to tonight? have one room. Yes, ma'am. What do you mean, one room? I need one room, and it has to have one broom. You're saying a you separate room? room? No, one room, and it needs to have one broom. On the Wingate, Newcastle. I can smell someone too. Cross. Hello? Hello, sir. Hello? Hello? Yes. How are you, sir? Uh, can you My phone messes yes. up. I'm sorry. No, that's fine. Uh, I was wondering. I, I was wondering if you have any vacancy, vacancy for the eclipse on Monday. Hi. Yes. Um, do you have any rooms available for the vacancies uh, for the eclipse on Monday? Oh, you know, uh, what? Which Wingate are you trying to call? Because we we um, yeah we have availability here, but we're in Newcastle, Colorado. Yeah, the the eclipse is going to be in like Jersey across the tip of Texas. Oh, oh okay. Oh, um, so you guys have vacancies? on oh, no, thank you. Yeah, but we do have vacancies. That would be great for me. Absolutely. Let me let me talk. Let me let you talk to my brother strangely. Yes. Okay. So, so the, we will not be able to see the eclipse there. Oh, uh, you could see the. So eclipse, we'll not be able to see the eclipse there. Yeah, you can see. The, where Where are you at right now? I'm on my roof. Oh, uh, roof. okay. Uh, I meant what? I meant what? What state are you in? Are you in Colorado? Oh, I'm in the state of. Yes. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah. Uh, uh, yes. Okay, yeah. We have a, we yeah. There's plenty of uh, vacancy for Monday. If that's what, yeah, if, yeah, if that's what, what you're asking, but the, hey, the shut up for a second. That, let me let you talk to my brother. Okay, we need one eclipse, please. We need oh. one eclipse, please. One, one eclipse. Okay. Yes, one eclipse, so you, please. You want to one eclipse, want to reserve, please. You want to reserve? Yes, we're trying. To, we are trying to do a Mason, yes, we are trying to do a Masonic ritual at the eclipse, so we hey, can man, get lots of money. Don't, they don't sell the Mitsubishi Eclipse anymore, man. What's your hey, problem? Who the hell is this guy? Who's this on the phone? They don't have. They don't have. Yeah, I think we're on a, somehow on some kind of three-way call here. How about this? Can you? I'm not in the freaky stuff. I'm not a swinger, dude. I don't like pretty. Total eclipse okay. of the heart. Okay. All right. Here, Total uh, eclipse of the heart. Now we could just bend over and spread your butt cheeks, and we could get the eclipse tonight. We can just bend over and see your butt cheeks and we can get the eclipse back. tonight. And then I'll show you a blood show moon. Blood I'll show you my blood moon. Days and Sweets, this is Eric speaking. Hello? 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 Hi. Hi. This is the Days Eric? In. Yep. Hi. What, what oh, can good. I do for I'm you? I got you. Uh, I was driving by earlier, and there was a man outside, and he was uh, dressed as though he worked for you, and he came over because my car, I was stopped for a minute, I was on the phone, and he came over, and he asked me, you know, oh, you want to stay here, you want to stay here, we have good rates, you know, and then he he tried to get into my vehicle, so I drove off, because that weirded me out, but he said he worked there, he said his name was Eric or something. Um, well, I can promise you I didn't try to get into anybody's vehicle earlier. Okay. Well, it's, it's really weird because you, you sound just like you. Well, that didn't happen earlier. That's really weird. Let me put my uh, my brother on. He he's, he's he saw him, too. Here. Is this the guy? Take the phone. Take it. No. Hello? Hello? Sir? We were pulled over on the phone, and we saw the man. He okay. works for you? Yep. You're trying to claim that he this gave is me a lighter to He gave me a lighter to smoke my cigarette. 
Did he have dark hair? He had brown hair. Was he wearing glasses? He had a monocle. Sounds <laughs> <laughs> a motel. Can I help you? Hi. Hey. Um, I have a few questions for you. Really quick. Do you have more plywood downstairs? Any what? More plywood. Do I have any plywood? Yeah, I need no, more I need... plywood up here. I've been um, mostly putting planks against the windows near the door. I, mean, I need I more, to? though. Who am I talking to? Brad. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Brad. Brad who? Hey, Brad, pass the hammer. Hey, here it goes. Start over here. Where is the paint, man? Where is the paint? Hey, can, we, can we get some more wood over here? I'm passing the ladder to Joe. Oh, whoa. Oh. Okay. You also, man. Watch what you're hey, doing, don't man. Set off the explosives. I meant, I meant the fireworks. Nobody go in there. Ew. Sue Smelly, we're gonna have to we're gonna have to wall off this room too. All right, we got we gotta wall off the bathroom. Come on, guys. I'm taking measurements right now. We're gonna cut that drywall. We'll get it done five minutes easy. What are you talking about? Thank you, guys. What room are you working on? Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna make this place better. That 215 was it, fellas? Sorry, we got you on speakerphone there, Hall. Yeah, thanks for putting out that uh, fire. Oof. Yeah, we got. We'll get this electrical sorted out. We we'll just get somebody in the breaker room or something to shut this shit off for 15 minutes or something. No way. Hold on. The room numbers on it's the coming computer. at me. No, I'm oh, not on fire. I'm just here to fire. Hey, yo, pass me the canister is in. That was the last goddamn drill bit you're going to get for free from me, motherfucker. You don't, you don't strip this out hell, again, dude? goddamn. I thought we were brothers. Oh, he hit his goddamn thumb again. I'm going to have to change the whole goddamn how many days since an incident to fucking want to get... God damn it. We can't get blood on the wood. We're going to ruin our bonuses, boys. We're renovating this whole wing. Wake those motherfuckers up, too. I'm going to stand on my head. We got more rooms to do than this. I don't care who's in there. We're getting contracted. I don't got time. I I schedule it for way less time. No, I'm going to stand on my head. I'm allowed to do that. That's part of my break. That's fine. You, Smoke it wherever you want. Where do you want to put the people? Oh, man, I'm, I'm going to stand on my head. I love and you. you guys can't oh. have one knee. Quality in. Hi. Uh, Hello, uh, sir. Hello. Hello? Hi, yeah. We were eating pizza in the room, and the room got sticky. And now we have a sticky situation in the room. Uh, the tomato sauce it went everywhere because the, the pizza flipped over when my brother he sat on the bed and it was on the bed and it went it went flying and then it went on the floor and now it's all sticky and it got on the wall and it's all sticky there it's tomato and it's red spicy what am I damn to do? honey on everything damn it on the curtains damn it wipe that off what do I do so what do you need to clean it up with. Oh, I don't know. I mean, what? how do you get tomato out of everything? Like, I've used boiling water before. That worked. But I, I think that would hurt the walls, right? It might, like, it might make them dissolve. Because that'll be like what happened last night uh, at the other place. And, you know, the wall, it dissolved. And, when my, and my brother put his hand through it, and it, it stopped. It stopped being a wall. He went right through. 
No, our walls don't dissolve. Okay, but, well, I don't know, because, uh, you know... Is that a challenge? There's a part by the wall, by the toilet, that's, like, dissolving. Like, my brother was peeing on it earlier, and he, and he peed right through into the next room. There was a lady over well, there. Well, why ain't he peeing happy. in the toilet? Oh, because it looked interesting. He wanted to see if he could blast it away, you know, and go, you, you know... You know blast. what? I'm going to charge you guys extra. Well, you can't okay. pee in a goddamn a toilet. Yeah, well, you know, he was it was a game. You know, you ever go to But like, we don't the play games like that here. But we, Why don't well, you guys do. pack your stuff up and get out? Well no, we just wanna pee. <laughs> I'm peeing. I don't care if you ain't gonna pee on my goddamn walls. I just wanna pee. It's not the pee, it's the pizza sauce. Look at that. Yeah, the pee. tomato sauce. We're peeing off the wall. Cause that's I'd working. I pee on the wall. I'd pee on the bed. We don't want to dissolve the wall. We just want to pee on I'd the pee wall. Pee on the curtain. We'll get rid of the tomato sauce. Look, it's like a racer on the walls. It goes in and it goes blah 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 blah, and it's not there, Dad. Look, I pee on the walls. Put my brother on. Brother, here, take the phone. Talk to him about the peeing. Hey, hey, how are you? Yeah. We were you guys we, on we the ran out of pee. We can't pee anymore. We peed all our pee. Can you come pee with us? Yeah, I'm all right. You pee. guys pack yeah, your stuff up. I want you out of home. here. We're pee. gonna start using poop now. We're gonna start do using poop now. I want you to pack your stuff up and get out now, I'm or I will call the cops. <laughs> A churro just came out of my butthole. All right, that's it. I'm calling the cops and have you physically removed. Wait, wait, wait. No, no touch. No touch. Wait, wait, wait. I'll throw a piece. You got to stay on the line. It's like you can't leave. Because all this stuff is happening. We're peeing. We're peeing. Listen. Why is it happening? He's peeing. We're in the bathroom. Oh, Oh, wow. Jesus, guys. Did you see what he just did? What's your room number? It's the one with all of the pee. Oh my god. It. It's coming out of the underneath the door and out of the windows. It's all the pee. It's so quiet. It's so quiet. It's pee coming out of the shoes, man. What the hell? I peed myself. I, I, what I hope you room are, are you in? Because, wow. I'm in the womb. I'm in the womb. I'm in the third trimester. No, don't tell him that. Don't tell him that. Of the womb. Of in utero. We don't know. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Watching that again. Wow. What's your room number? Room number one. <laughs> Look at that the water one, go. The one by the ice machine. The ice machine room. What, you see well, what room from number, number is that? One. He's from number two. It's on the opposite side. We got the tens. Everybody's out here. It's in the hall now. There's pee everywhere. Oh, there's oh, the radio they got the working. boom box. There you go. I thought we peed on it. They're peeing all over this cardboard pad where people are break dancing to the song, talking about touch it. We're all out in the in the common area. I love this YouTube song. Yeah, this touch YouTube it, sounds touch good. It. Motherfucker, you. Strange. Quit twerking so hard. You hey, gonna rip your pants. This pee tastes really good. This pee tastes real good. Thanks for calling, Winket. Uh, let me put my Hello, on. sir. Yes, how may I Hello? Hear you? Hello, uh, how I'm may I assist you? The room. Can you hear me? Yes, I am. Yes, I can. Hello, can you hear me? go yes ahead. No. Yes or no? Yes, I can. Yes or no? Hello? I will say, I, I'm sorry, I hung up. Thank you for calling, Hello? Wingate. This is Mark. Can I help you? I'm sorry, I hung up the phone. I'm sorry, my phone doesn't work very well and I can't hear. Can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you. Hello? Okay. Can I you just hear wanted me? to say I'm up in the room here. I hear you, yes. You sound beautiful. 
Um, I'm up here in the room, and I'm frying some chicken in the room. Would you like some? No, thank you. You want I'm frying chicken in the room. What's your room number? It tastes really good. My room number? Oh, so you want some? You want some get them? Obviously, sir. I would love to. Okay, I'm in room 105. All right. Thank you. I'll be there within a few minutes. Come fry chicken. Mm-hmm. Come fry my chicken. And could you please Hello? help me with the name on reservation as well? No, the name is Colonel Sanders. Mm-hmm. And I'm frying chicken in the room. Okay. Nice to hear that. Now, would, is there anyone else working so I can make more? Looking complete, this is Brooklyn. Hello, Brooklyn. Can you hear me? Hello? Hi. Hello? Yeah, I'm in here. I'm with one of your boys. I think he works for you. And me and my family were playing this game of Monopoly with him. And he was trying to tell us that the parkway and the boardwalk was part of Baltic Avenue. And, like, he's with you, right? I'm sorry. Who am I speaking to? This is Philip Harmonica. Um, and I'm out here with my family. And we've been, like, this guy was, like, kind of he, he room service guy. You know, just kind of like a you know, front desk or whatever. He came up. Brought us what we needed, and you know we were playing Monopoly, and he came up. So, and there's kind of been a bit of a dispute. I don't know if you heard the smoke alarm, but he got real mad. Um, okay, give me one so, second. I'm gonna just check. Okay. Check on what? Four dollars. No, I'm telling you, it's Parkway and Boardwalk, and those are the blue ones. And you got okay, fucking Okay. Um. What Avenue. hotel? What hotel are you um, staying at right now? Cause, yeah. I'm at, I'm at your. I know where I'm calling, ma'am. Please, we've been we've been through this. Is this? So um, are you calling La Quinta and Suites and Rifle? Yes, ma'am. Yes. And this man okay, works for um, you. He, as I, he brought us. Did you get his name? Stuff. I we I don't know. We we've been playing. I, I honestly. What is I your room number? The because he was doing so good. I What's don't know your if it room was, number? Uh, two, two fifteen or twenty one fifteen. We've been in the room. We've been in here a long time. But listen, this guy, like, he was trying. Listen, you've played Monopoly, right? Got, and family, yeah. back me up on this, guys. You're on speakerphone okay. with my family. The guy, Hi. Here, this little Hi. Indian man. Hi. Um. This Indian okay. guy says his name is, is he like Ted, but I don't believe him. Uh, we're frying chicken and playing Monopoly. Okay. Um, give me one second, okay? But, I'll no, call you guys right listen, back, okay? We're playing Monopoly, right. You know that Parkway and the Boardwalk are like the best blue. It's like the highest paying. And he got the Baltic Avenue. He got the Baltic Avenue and the other one that I can't remember. I can't see. There's a smudge on the board. But, like, he was trying to say that, like, oh, no, he was trying to get more than it was worth. And so, like, shit fucking broke out. You know what I mean? He was spraying the he he was spraying spraying my, my, my fire extinguisher on the board trying to erase it. <laughs> and I honestly like he was trying all he was trying to be banker. Thank you for calling uh, the Hampton Inn and Sweets Rifle Colorado. For reservations Spray press one. For all other questions or Bye to- guys, I go have sex. Guys later. Bye. Bye. Hey, Strange, thank you for coming. I love right, you, bye, baby. Life. Love you, honey, baby. Bye. Bye. Hi. 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 Yeah, my family's here. Uh, yes, Axel, uh, tell them the room we want. Yeah, I want the room that's not full of uh, other people's stuff. Because we're here, but like other people's stuff is in here. This isn't our stuff. Uh, I'm, I'm fixing to sell it. Maybe I can pawn it off. Are you in my, you are in my room. Take, yeah, get back in the stuff. bathroom, man. Get back in the bathroom. We'll tell you. I'm sorry. I go in the bathroom. Get back in. Can wait. I'm sorry. Yeah. 
Where the fuck are you? I, uh, I'm yeah. the door. So what? What's the deal? Cause we were we were booked for here, and we're in here. We have we got in with the key. And there's other this other guy, and he's in the bathroom, and he says this is his room, and all his stuff's in here. But our stuff was in here first. What room are you in? Uh, what was it two one five? I think. I don't so. have any rooms that are too That is a different. It sure is actually, sir. Well, it we'll is different rooms. Place, cause this is because where the door between the rooms, it is different room. You cannot open the door between the rooms, yeah, no, sir. I opened the door. And you're in our no, room. no. We are first time from Germany, and we know that these open doors are not good. Well, you talk to her. You you figure this out, because I'm tired. I have to take Hello? A Can you hear me? I'm sorry, I think you guys called the wrong hotel. Why would you say that? Hello? There is a man and I am for first time from Germany staying in your hotel room. Hey, are you guys are you guys opening doors? And this man is opening doors between the conjoined rooms and he is looking at me. And one hey, of them said his name um, He was downing I'm not the cloud you. and he I'm just stared door. at me. And he said I didn't want to look at you. I I just I want to see what was happening over here. Why are there two doors in this room that's open into other rooms? This is like a triple okay. combined maybe, room. Okay, maybe maybe I should just, maybe I should just leave. Go we'll leave and we'll take your room. Okay, you guys. All right, I'm gonna leave. Bye. <coughs> Hello, can you hear me? Yes. What hotel are you in? I'm in your... There's a man playing a song that is very lewd. Oh, no. Who put that in there? That is... Who, there's a man with the extinguisher has made the, the alarms go off. He had said... Did we not hear... This is not my phone. There was a man talk to you, but they opened the door to my room. And, and it's I thought there was a man. Son, yes. Don't sit there on fire anymore. There's a whole family. Do you hear them? Oh, they're setting off a hey, guys, um, Why are you guys doing all this ruckus? I'm trying to sleep. Is gift ein kleines Pferdchen like a tiny horse or something? I heard too. That was weird. Wow, wow. Life. You got. <laughs> Holy shit. Is that a fire extinguisher you got? There was a man who was uh, making a song. Dance party. And he said he touched it. <laughs> okay. Oh, yeah, let's twerk. Make it maybe, maybe I could hang out for, you know, for like a couple of months. Yeah. And twerk. Well, I do have beers in this cooler. One, this song is two, pretty lit. Three. Oh, hell yeah. Thanks, man. Hi, people. Hi. Yeah, if we you come to the front desk, we'll get it figured out for you. This is Wait. a really fun hotel. <laughs> Hi, fat people. You you sound wonderful. You come up to the party to the room. We drink the beers and we hear the song. What a man who says it like Will he said touch it. Will you come up and twerk with this? Ask her. Uh oh. Is that my dad? Can I can I fuck you in the room? Uh oh. Do not make me bite this pillow, sir. You always so horny. Oh. We'll see what happens. The night I guess the pillow looks soft, and I guess I will bite it for you, Mr. Can you have a so horny, horny. fucker? He's so horny. He's so horny. <laughs> if you Shut up. That's Come you don't fucking say something to say something. Don't sit there mumbling and fucking giggling. You're not a little ass girl. Twerk. Talk like a fucking grown woman. Yeah. <laughs> not a girl. Talk like a fucking grown woman, man. you little ass kid. Do not listen to the man with the big fat sacks. 
He come in with his big, big fat sacks, making all the men feel like inferior to his big sacks. <laughs> it's true, I saw one of them time. Where the fuck is room service? Play that music again. That YouTube. Why don't get off your fat ass and come help us? There's so many rooms conjoined together in this room. It's like, it's like the whole floor is conjoined. He touched it and make it happen. He has to Yes, did you hear the man say, love you your music. touch it, touch it, you motherfucker, you in the song that you play over your speakers? A little cross. He yeah. touch it, make, make it. Complaint work. for you, he said, make naked. it work. There's too many voices. Take the floor. Hang up on this bitch. She sounds dumb. <laughs> why are you concerned? Yeah, why are you concerned? <laughs> I'm not concerned. Why See, are you she's concerned? not even paying attention this to the call conversation. This call may be monitored or recorded for training purposes. Bro, bro. Hi, who is this? <laughs> Where did you say you were calling from? Hello? It's funny that you should call because my third eldest, Larissa, was talking about it last week. Someone did call last week about the same thing, was that you? No. I think it was somebody else. She was the first in the family to go to university. So we're all really quite proud of her. Uh-huh. Oh, I'm sorry, I couldn't exactly hear you there. Okay, I'm going to hang up now. What was that again? Wait, 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 wait. Could you say that again, please? That I'm going to hang up? No. Ow! You can't do that, man. You can't do that. Stop spraying me with that. There's too many rooms conjoined. There's all this ha- stuff happening. Why aren't you here? Why aren't you Jesus. not here? <coughs> He's spraying it. <coughs> He's spraying it. I bugged the department. Come on, that Yo, can, can, can you let me by. hold it? Okay, bye. I'm going to spare you with it. Bye. This is Byron. Hi, this is Jackson with the Ellery. We had a phone call. You're a point to this. I'm sorry? Hello? How should I know? How should you know what, sir? I don't even know who you are. I just said that my name oh, is okay. Jackson. I'm with the Ellery. We you didn't tell me why you were concerned. Oh, so this is one of those robo blockers. Yeah, That's yeah. Right. Why are you concerned? Here. So here. Why are you concerned? Why are you concerned? Concerned about uh, concerning voicemail that was left? Why are you concerned? Because it was directed to us about a guest staying in our property. Why are you concerned? Why are you concerned? Because it was a guest staying in our property, according to the voicemail. I don't want you to explain it to me. I never asked you to explain it to me. Yeah, so it's a, it's a, it's a spam. It's one I said, why are you concerned? It's a program that... Um, are you still talking? Yes. Uh, I'm not yelling at you. I'm talking to you. See? Why? Why Why does that concern you? Why does that concern you? 
uh, people who were fed up with uh, robot robo callers. Who cares? Text uh, voices and then response. So why are you telling me? Like one is like. Uh, why are you concerned? Like area fifty one. I want to hear why. Tell me why. Yeah, it's it's very why? why? Yeah, why? Why are you concerned? So what the voicemail robo person? Ten, name give me one good reason. Because I mean That's the point. Who cares? Why are you concerned? So it, it's gonna keep going. I said why are you concerned? Um huh? Is it gonna stop or no. does it have to hang it, up? It, it has like the the people who develop them have like yeah, you are. You are. Of, like, pre-recorded generated messages. You didn't tell me why you were concerned. So note how it's now run out of things. Why are you concerned? Why are you concerned? People continue to get aggressive to, like, freak the Why does that concern you? Why does that concern you? Isn't that, isn't that awesome, though? So why? Cool. Why were you concerned? So, because of the fact that uh, the person's phone auto did like filtered up the spam because we're business, yeah yeah why are you concerned? Automatically filters to this app that you you pay it's like a twenty five dollars. Why are you concerned? Auto filter like spam calls and robot calls. I'm right it, yeah, it's a it's a fair amount. Why are you concerned? <laughs> Why? Why? Why does that concern you? Why does that concern you? Why are we elongated? Why are you concerned? Why? Why? Why does that concern you? Why does that concern you? I, I've heard that some of these like. Why are you concerned? Why are you concerned? Whole conversation. So no, you did. In order to. No? No. I can handle these kinds of things. It's just let it run. Well, it's not even just let it run, because, I mean, it will go for hours. Oh. Like, hours and hours and hours. Nope. Uh, that if you do have a genuine message for the person... So why are you telling me? ...fill it in, uh, in the background. So uh, when it does its pause... Yeah. That's, that's the point. Who cares? Why are you concerned? So as we uh, noted, sir, we did have a voicemail come through to our phone from this phone number. Uh, and the reason why we're calling is because of the fact that it was a very concerning voicemail. If somebody could please give us a call back just to ensure that the guest who did call our number, leave that voicemail, is doing all right, it would be greatly appreciated. Um, oh, okay. Just to ensure that you have another... You know, uh, another call from this number like that, leaving another concerning voicemail. It will be forwarded to the authorities as it will be considered harassment. Thank you nope. very much. Have an excellent rest of your day. You know, everybody, our Madhouse Militia family is on a journey together. Together, we can overcome all adversity, pain, and fear, and anger in our world at our problems melts away the grief of our troubles as we find that our strength is the power of laughter, kindness, and joy. Learning that the differences between us all are trivial and that we're all really more alike than different. Ain't that the truth? That we're healing our collective souls with the magical power of laughter right here on the Madhouse Militia Show Refresh. Friday at the noon, right here in your earballs. Madhouse Militia is saving the world one laugh at a time. I want to thank all the machines for joining in tonight and keeping this show a rolling. I tell you what, man, it's been a good time cheering up my heart and uh, all the prayers that were sent out for the white machine for Papa McClanahan work out and Milkman wants to ask you please pray for my mama she's in the hospital and uh, we don't know what's going on and it's really weighing heavy on my heart so if you could spare a prayer for mama mama milk I sure'd appreciate it I love you just as much and even more and we're dropping the dimes we only ask that you give us the time better yet bring an enemy 
bring a friend because they're always going to be welcome right here in the in the, the, the madhouse militia. See, I'm thinking about my mom. Sorry about that. But I love each and every one of you. And dear Carlito, cross up in heaven with the golden earphones on, guiding us to the way of happiness and joy right here on this crazy planet. Earth. Thank you so much. And my dear brother Axel, I couldn't do it without you. We're carrying this gigantic heavy torch forward and spreading the word that love can still be found right here and we can all get along and all the kids play together. Axel, God bless you. I hope you get feeling a little bit better real soon. Yeah, Thank you so much for putting up with the whole thing. Please. 